Thank you, Dr. Prosecki. It's great to be here, young people. You all are representing Decatur Township quite well, so good job hanging there. There's like two more of us, okay? We're almost there. All right. Um, it's always exciting to be here and to have the honor to be a part of these initiatives that have been uh, so boldly funded by our legislators, thank you, uh, and supported by the Indiana Department of Education, thank you. And this is what Indiana Learns is really about. So when I was asked if Indianapolis Public Schools would like to be a matching district, my answer was yes. And in fact, we've already earmarked dollars waiting for this announcement. Um, why that is, is because we know, research shows us over and over again, that tutoring is a viable and effective method to combat learning loss and educational inequities. Like every other school district in the nation, the pandemic disrupted the everyday in-person learning that we know our young people had come to be accustomed to. And like every other school district in the nation, we're working incredibly hard to make up for some of that lost time. Um, our district has used some of our federal dollars already to launch an internal district-wide tutoring program, which has helped us to achieve back to our pre-pandemic or near those pre-pandemic numbers, but we aren't where we need to be or want to be, which means there's more work to do with our young people. And Indiana Learns will help us do just that. So as a member district of Indiana Learns, IPS will proudly provide a matching grant to all eligible students in our district, bringing that total available to $1,000 per eligible IPS student. It's a commitment that we're making to our students and one I encourage, as Dr. Prosecki did, all of our districts across Indiana to make for their students as well. As a former middle school teacher, uh, we know very well as teachers what happens when our students get additional supports outside of the classroom to help them really move their progress forward, and Indiana Learns will do just that. So again, thank you, Dr. Jenner, for your work, to the Mind Trust team for administering the grant, for the General Assembly, for the vision to make these dollars available, and to all of my colleagues, let's get on board, and let's make sure we're supporting Indiana Learns. Thank you. Now, I'm pleased to introduce my esteemed colleague, Dr. Leanne Kwiatkowski of Muncie Schools. <laughs> 